Hi guys, I hope you're alright. I went to the Pixie again last weekend with some friends with the idea of trying two v 8 in Stanish Plantation. One was Captain Hook that I tried on my last visit and the other one was Civis Traverse which I couldn't try last visit but it was on my wish list. After doing a bit of a warm up on easy climbs I went to try Green Traverse which I couldn't send last time and surprised myself by taking it on the first attempt of the day. Psych was high so I moved the mats to Captain Hook to give it some good burns and hopefully send it. It's a compression based problem that starts on a good edge. There's a short move to a crimp, you reach out to a nice hold and then you have to slap to your left hand through the lip until you get to the nose. Then once you get there you have to top out. As I had previously worked on the moves a few weeks ago, I started trying it from the bottom. I got as far as I had got last time on the first try, so I felt like I had a chance to send it. Regardless the first impressions of the day, I only got to the same point in almost every attempt, but I wouldn't get my hand just where it needed to be to make the next move possible. I didn't really know if I need some extra micro beta, or I'm simply not strong enough to reach out to the little edge in the nose with a simple sign. I think it has to do a tiny bit more with not being strong enough, so I guess I'll have to train compression and power more to feel a bit more confident of this. Feeling humbled, I decided to move on and try Civis Traverse. I didn't want to waste all my skin in Captain Hook as I wasn't making any actual progress on it. Civis Traverse is a line that climbs mostly on slopey holds and then you have a crack section to reach a jug. Once you reach the jug, there is an easy top out. First impressions on Civis Traverse were good. I didn't expect to come off the ground on the first few attempts and I actually got a few moves in. I ended up trying the same thing over and over again and yet kept asking myself why I was falling all the time. It was only the first day so after an hour or so I decided to stop and call it a day to save some energy and skin for the following days. On the second day, rain was predicted in Stanich, so we decided to go to an area that seemed dry. This was Burbage South Valley, an area with some nice boulders. In this area, the sheep caught my attention. Sorry, not this sheep, a problem called the sheep, which is a 1 meter 7 8 problem that I found quite balance dependent, in which I didn't get very far apart from touching that slot and holding it a couple of times definitely want to try again on a future visit. Anyway, despite trying to be conservative and save some skin for the last day, I ended up climbing quite a lot and tried the sheep so many times which totally trust my skin. So at the end I wasn't expecting much from the third and last day in the pigs. After not being able to send the sheep and having barely no skin left, I think it was pointless to try Sipis Traverse again. I wanted to have a look and not to be taken away, which is this beautiful line in the Crescenta Red area that has been on my wish list for a while. Anyway, my friends wanted to go to the Pebble area again, which is where Sipis Traverse is. So I thought I could maybe try to sort out a beta that could work for me on a future trip. <laughs> I managed to put some more bits together and somehow it seemed like it could work. My expectations to send it though were really low but at the same time I knew I wouldn't be coming to the pigs again in probably months. So even if I had really little skin left it was worth trying to put it all together. So I taped up my split fingers and hoped for the best. I think knowing my chances of sending the problem were low, 
meant I approached the problem in a more relaxed mindset, so I took the pressure off myself. After sorting out a sequence that could work for me, I went full on and tried the problem from the bottom. I was so chuffed to send it as I had no skin left and barely any expectations at all. Anyway, that's all for today folks, I hope you enjoyed the video, if that's the case please like it, share it, drop a comment and subscribe to the channel.